the Ferial Workshop and Wave 3 is here along with a bunch of other things for Season of Love. So let's get in, shall we? Now, the biggest thing which I am most excited for today is Epic Wallaby is actually here. Like, what? <laughs> that is so surreal. I saw inside a promotion yesterday, which someone showed me a brand new bird of Wallaby. So, there's Epic Wallaby. What? <laughs> my plan is today is to go around the carousel, see what's new. Right. Oh, my God. Look, look. Wallaby. Wallaby. Okay. <laughs> look at Wallaby's bird. Oh, it's white. Oh, I am so excited. Okay, so I've decided to go in game instead of checking out the trailer because I just want to see what's new guys so we're going on over to fire oasis right now <gasps> epic will be it is actually here i thought it was rainbow head but this is a million times better like what this is so surreal oh my god i'm workshop <laughs> okay okay keep calm mpg it is okay <laughs> Let's have a look. Uh, it's Epic Wallaby. Oh my god. I wanted to get Wallodog here because Wallodog is obviously named after Wallaby, but it's feeling a bit poorly. So <laughs> he's left out on the action today. Right. I know the combo has Waddle, but I'm just going to quickly search. Oh my god. This thing does not work fast enough. I feel like I'm wrecking my own sight at this point. Right. Come on. Come on. Come on. Waddle and Boskus. Waddle and Boskus is Epic Wallaby. Boskus, this thing, it can't go fast enough. Do you understand how long I have waited for a, one of my favorites to have a rare or an epic? That means we are Getting actually close to a rare peg in the guys and red Capricorn. A regular red blurts. A red bleatnik. Oh my god. <laughs> Where is it? Waddle, Boskus, where are you? I really want this thing to be really cute. It was really dark with the rare variant, so I'm hoping they can be more lively this time. I am actually quaking right now. <laughs> what is this? Why do we have Workshop Wave 3 and everything else? How is this real? I don't know. It's like the Festival of Yay all over again, and I'm all here for it. All right, I'm going to click this retry button. <laughs> that sometimes escapes my grasp, but today... I am using that thing. Oh, I thought it was blue the bird, but it's white. Oh my god. You can't watch the shot behind this thing. I mean, come on, there's so much to check out in game. A one minute 30 shot where you see everything. No, thank you. I want to see everything in game. I'm actually quite surprised that it's a monster handler shot again because I felt like we were going to get a trailer because it's been a really long time since the fire expansion one. They must have something brewing over there if they aren't using it for a, a workshop one. That means exciting things are coming, man. I mean, if that isn't being used for workshop, what are you planning on making the next trailer for? That's what I want to know. I'm so scared what every Wallaby is going to look like. It's got to be so cool. Colorful. Not like rare Wallaby. I want it to be a bit more brighter. Take on a more colorful, playful tone. Like... Heck it, they're almost with different hues to it. Be playful. I think that's the MPG vibe. Be playful. An MPG will love you. <laughs> oh, I got it. Oh, I can't control my emotions. MPG, it is okay. Every will be. <gasps> if you're watching me for the first time, this is one of my favorites. So this means a lot to me, okay? Oh, it's like a Yeti. Oh. Oh, 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 it's got icicle like cons coming from it. What is this? I can't. Let's go. I want to see. Oh, that's amazing. Oh my god, I can't. That's amazing. It's, it's rainbowy. It's the go. Oh my god. There's no way this is real. I... Oh my god. I love you so much. Go away, Sperry. One sec here, guys. <laughs> we we got to deal with this one. Right, let's go and place the... Wow. Oh my god. This is my favorite rare or epic ever. This is amazing. I don't even need to see this. This is genuinely my favorite. Look at the tail. Oh, this is adorable. This is my favorite thing ever. Oh my god. Talk about an upgrade. Look at the stars on it. Oh. Oh, look at the moons as well. This is so adorable. You have never, ever astounded me as much as what I am with this epic. Oh, thank you so much. Oh. Oh. 
Oh my god, I, I, I'm, I'm astounded. I can't right now. What, what, Aries it's called. Okay, I'm gonna call it after Wallardog, because Wallardog couldn't be here today. Let's call it Wallardog. Wait, no, Rainbow. Wallardog. <laughs> Maybe it should be, no, it should be called Nyan Wallardog. Because it's nyan, 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 nyan. It's got the nyan cat vibes. I love it. It's rainbowy. It is adorable. I can't. Okay, I'm saying this is my profile picture right now. This is my new profile picture forever. Maybe not forever. <laughs> Wait, I love it. Oh, oh, that could not have been any better. I love it. Look at his face. It is adorable. Oh, look at your jump. You are so cute. Look at the difference as well. So huge. I love this thing. Okay, let's have a little, little look at this, shall we? When monsters are having trouble getting to sleep, they're frequently invited to picture a flick of wallabies leaping over a fence and count them as they pass. Imagine the monster world's collective surprise, then to discover an extra special wallaby invading their waking thoughts and pastures. This Empyrean fire epic looks as if it belongs among the orbs of the firmament. And it's dreamy string plugging birds have the plumage to match. Oh, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> if one locks eyes with an epic wallaby, it said you can glimpse visions of an outlandish domain set against an impossible starscape and reachable only by walking the steps of the special stair. What is this a reference to? Please help me. I don't know, but it's so cool and I love it. Oh, oh how, how are we supposed to beat that today? I don't know. That could not be beaten. Right, I'm getting my diamonds. I'm not looking in the mailbox because I'm scared you're going to show me something I don't want to see. Just yet. I can't move on. Okay, we will move on. You're so cute. Oh my god. I can't. Okay, MVG, it's time to move on. I know you really don't want to, but it's for the season of love. There is more things to be discovered. Right, so Red Bookworm is here today. Oh, yay! Let's have a look at Rare Bookworm, then. Wait, hold up a sec. Spin wheel, get her out of the way! Do you understand how much new content I have to discover today? And Epic Wallaby! Oh, God. Right, wait, wait, wait. This monster is that special. Epic Wallaby. <laughs> <laughs> Epic Wallaby. <laughs> now everyone can know my excitement behind this monster before it's even happened. There you go, everyone. Which monster should we get rid of? So we've got a Rare Ruba and then a Rare Octopus. I need to think about the elements behind these for my Celestials. I think I'm going to get rid of Rare Ruba. I think maybe the rare wobblins will need rare octopus. So I'm going to take that risk. Okay, let's have a look on the website again. What is the combo? <laughs> rare bugworm. It is periscope and bonkers. Effie will be has put me in such a good mood right now. I don't think anything can disappoint me. And that's saying a lot because I feel like I've had quite a bit of disappointment recently. So we had baby smoochal and then red knucklehead, which I thought was really disgusting. So I'm really excited now because we have so much awesome stuff today. Can you guys actually believe that Epic Wallaby was that great? I cannot. It's overtook Rare Poke, and that is my current favorite rare or epic, I would say. And that's saying a lot. Give me Red Pig and the Red Topricon instantly right now i mean come on it was a rainbow it's based on space of course i was gonna love it red bookworm though i'm hoping that this one is gonna be a butterfly that was the hope you know what this just it isn't working i don't feel like i'm gonna be able to breed it do we have a look inside of the market Ooh, i want to have a look we're on a roll let's have a look then oh it's right behind here let's have a look oh oh Oh, it's a little fashionable teacher. Oh, get you, Rare Bookworm. Well, actually, I really love that. Oh, it's Rainbowy again. Season of love, season of love. We love the season of love. <laughs> if, oh, my God, rainbows are bound. Oh, I love this. Wow, really heavily based on the season of love, aren't you, Rare Bookworm? Should we have a look then? Oh, my God. I need to see this more in full because it looks great, this design. You're perhaps familiar with cooking the books. But have you ever heard of baking the books? You want Bookworm? You are. I love <laughs> That's the rare bookworm's specialty. In place of the typical stack of unapproachable bibliots, the seasonal concocts layers of sugary confections that cause the fantastical fictions to be imagined upon their delication. Oh my god, that's such a cool idea! Wow! Rather than using one's eyes to perceive the written word, these stories are delivered and deciphered via digestation. <laughs> what is this upon? 
digestion. Excuse me, digestion. What is this about right now? Sometimes I wish I just could read at the bottom of the bios the Easter eggs or references. That would be awesome. There are some who argue that the only way to enjoy a book is to read it the old fashioned way. But as far as the rare bookworm is concerned, encouraging a love of literacy by any means necessary is a reference to fate for success. <laughs> What an icon. Well, we love this one. Let's buy it straight up, shall we? The rare seasonals have been a bit hard to breed, I've found, so I'm not going to risk it. I'm just going to go ahead and get it. Oh, let's have a full -on preview at this one, then. Oh, my God. Oh, another awesome one. Wow, the variants, they are killing it today. I love this one as well. Man, that's so cool. Oh, it even has wings at the back. No, wait, are you actually kidding me right now? <laughs> Oh my god! It's not only a butterfly, guys. It is a candy, lovely monster. Oh my god, look at them goggles, really. <laughs> Oh my god, the glasses. I'm gonna uh, put Red Ruber in the hotel for a sec. Let's have a look. Oh my god. Wow, these designs are so inventive today. Wow, I hope every single one can be like this in the future. Oh, look at the hair thing. I love how the ribbon looks like wings. Wow. It's based on one of the sugary worms now I can see it up close, isn't it? What are they called? I think they've got a really specific name in America. Or maybe a gummy worms. Is that what you call them? <laughs> <laughs> I hope I'm right. Oh, and all the chocolate. Wow, season of love themed as well this time. That's really cool. Oh my god. I do. I like these a lot. Do we have a look at you sleeping? Oh, you are adorable. You are a bundle of fun. Epic will let me. Will let me... <laughs> I love it. Okay, what else do we have today? Good day, slowly. Oh, we have to teleport rare bookworm. Now, that's a very easy quest. Let's just teleport you straight on over. I'll have a look over there, too, because it's a really easy thing for me to just do in the video, man. I don't have to spend any diamonds doing... <gasps> that looked cool. That looked cool. That looked cool. Oh, my God. I get to turn it off because... I don't like seeing things early, but the silhouette. I feel like this is going to be better than wave two. I'm really hopeful for that, man. The seasonal shanty song, it just is not, it's not even uplifted enough for my emotions today because I am just surreally bamboozled by how much stuff we have that's awesome. Okay, let's have a look at Rare Bookworm on here. I love how it's based on a candy worm. Maybe we save the butterfly one for up next, but even the ribbon, it does look like wings. Also, can we just bring up, is that a fork in the marble on it at the back? Or just a hairpin? <laughs> Poor Bookworm has been eaten. Very creative ideas on the Monstandless part though today. Wow. Oh, it is so cute. It's adorable. I want to eat you. I want to eat you all. <laughs> oh, wait, we have an ethereal as well today. I know which one this is. And I am so excited. It's like this update was meant for me, man. We have Ethereal Workshop. I was actually so worried because when I make theories, I sometimes go, what if I'm wrong? Because I don't want to excite you guys when I'm wrong, but that's not happened really so far. So that's a great thing. But we also today have epic socks. How is this even happening? I don't know. I brought up inside of my theories. This is actually my most wanted epic ethereal monster on ethereal island. So I cannot wait to see what this guy is going to do too. I mean, when I said that, I didn't actually expect to get it, you know? <laughs> and every wall of me. All right, I'm going to have a look in the market at this thing. Like we did for rare bookworm, shall we have a look? Oh, okay, let's have a look in the side of the market then. Wait, what? You took me back. No. I need workshop. I need epic socks. I need to. <gasps> oh my God. That is cute. cute. Not as cute as rare book worm. <laughs> Epi wallaby, I think, though. <gasps> oh, but it's so cool as well. 
I have that many cool designs. I can't comprehend this. This is so cool. It's like nine tails. Wow. Stuff though. This is awesome as well. Man, these are killing it today. If Workshop can do it as well, this is going to be one of my favorite days ever. Let's have a look at the bio then. Epic Soxers are reputed to be able to shapeshift into ghost-like apparitions. That's creepy. Ooh. But this is a misconception. The truth is far more unusual. <laughs> oh, of course it is. Okay. <laughs> These vulpine epic ethereals usually straddle parallel realities and have multiple traits to reflect this. They possess two tails, one from each continuity, the horned outgrowth that covers their heads, and horns never occur symmetrically. And the coloration calls forth imagery of suspicious spirits. <laughs> What? In one of Epic Sox's timelines, there's a thriving tourism industry in the monster world for some reason. And the soup of the day is the most popular for small talk. The monsters won't provide any further context for these cryptic clues, but they often perform soulful ditties that guess at what might have been if that reality had ever merged with the main one. Is this from the mirror dimension? I'm so confused. A ghost like show maybe it would be really cool if it was from the mirror dimension just saying we don't really know if there's anything that can just occur there so it would be nice to have something like that one day what do we do then right we go and get their epic socks let's go to mpg in the future who does the breeding combo <laughs> okay we are back and i have the combination right now it is wait one minute <laughs> let me have a look gel billy and bellow fish so i can finally go ahead and breed this thing wow i'm just gonna say i'm from the future right now because we didn't know the breeding combo before but what an update <laughs> wow. i am just so much in shock behind what we got like when you guys see my reaction to what's coming as well it just it doesn't stop i feel like i'm gonna have a lot of trouble breeding this thing because the epic ethereals they've been so hard but we're gonna have to go no way Oh my god, that wasn't actually that hard. Have I jinxed myself there? I don't know. I said it was going to be super hard, and then I went ahead and got it. That's wild. Okay, then let's just go ahead and get this thing. Wow, that was a lot easier than what I expected. Oh my god. Oh, now I'm seeing it up close for the first time. Yes, so cool. Wow, Red Book Woman Epic will be... Man... The fact that an epic ethereal wasn't the coolest thing today, I'm so happy about that. Epic Wallaby. Epic Wallaby! I love it. Let's place it down. The shoes on this guy look really weird. Shoes, claws, feet. Honestly, who knows the difference? <laughs> Let's place you down next to this guy. You see what I mean? Look really different, don't they? Oh, it's called Neko. That's a really cute man. Okay, let's move Gel Billy before the song comes on. Wow, that's really cool. The face of this guy, whoa. Okay, now it's time for Workshop though. Back to past MPG because we're here. Workshop is here. We're here. We're all happy, loving, wonderful beings right now. <gasps> oh, here we go. Every time this island gets an update, it is just a vibe. Okay, I'm gonna synthesize our new monster. Shall we have a look at our goals though and work out what it is? I'm curious, is Whale gonna play their new track? Oh, no new track for Whale today. Okay. Let's have a look inside of the goals tab. I feel like it's gonna come after Whale's pop, the secret bit that Whale apparently has. Oh, we have Piplash and Ven Shun. Oh, I like that name. That sounds so cool. Yeah, and the elements that we predicted. That's awesome. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and synthesize this thing. I've been getting, oh, oh wait, we have another upgrade to the synthesizer. Oh, exciting. Have a look. Oh, wow, there's something at the top now. Hyper-refined synthesizer, it's called now. Okay, let's have a little quick look at this. Right, I've just took a quick look because I didn't want to really read it in front of you guys, but the, it says that it now houses something else at the top. What is this something else? I want to know. It looks weird. I'm curious, is this going to have even more upgrades? I thought it was just you'd go triple, quad, and then maybe a quint upgrade, but now we're getting even more oh there's a retry button as well now that's nice okay let's try it for our monster then 
Oh, wow. It's already overloaded. I kind of am a bit jealous over the people who are just starting out on the island because it's going to be so much easier with these upgrades, man. Okay, let's go. Oh, my God. We got it first try. Oh, this one looks crazy. Okay. Feek me. <laughs> Feek me. I meant to write Feed me. <laughs> I don't know why it's called that. Let's have a look at this new one, man. Oh, I am so curious. You look very wooden. Oh, maybe a percussion monster. Please add so much. That'd be awesome. Oh, this one sounds like it's going to add a bunch. Okay, let's look away MPG because we want to see this quad for itself without the monster book. Yes, I know the monster book is very cool, but Piplash needs a moment here. Oh, I'm a bit scared after Baby Smoochel before I place it down. He's going to do something. That sound sounded so cool. Oh, you are vibing. <laughs> Dawson. <laughs> Oh, yo, that's nice. Oh, I like that. <laughs> the little bit of a quimmer there. <laughs> Bruh. We like that. You feel the beat, man. Oh, he's proper going for it, Pit Flash. I thought the most stable looking one so far, I'd say. But maybe the bio will change that. I'm surprised this guy doesn't play more. It has such a unique sounding sound. I suppose that goes for all of his ethereals, but still, right? How does this guy not play more? Wow, it only goes there. That's so strange. Should we listen to you one more time? Curious. Okay, I would have liked a bit more from you. But you are very sweet. I love it. I like how its ears are the ones that make it sound. So cool that they bob up and down like that. That's wild. Okay, let's go for his shadow quad now. I feel like this is going to be really hard to get. Right, I'm going to add Feek Me. <laughs> the very awesome name there. I don't think we're getting this one first try, man. Oh, that's perfect. The a shadow quad potentially is available and we have the shadow one being the main one you can get right now oh wait 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 we're not we're not forgetting this time i am gonna do the bios i get too carried away with workshop <laughs> so, i don't actually shape the bios but let's have a look at this guy's law first wow this triple element ethereal is not what we were expecting <laughs> i know right it's not even unstable it doesn't look like that this one in a class of monsters that includes some of the most unsightly species the pit plash exists in stark and striking contrast uh, definitely it's so cute and undearing even even its headbanging, stereotypically associated with hardcore genres, is absolutely delightful. You know, this one is such a contrast. This bio is so right. This bio's got its spot on what this monster is. What precisely is going on here? Is the Pit Plash harboring some secret, putting up a front, concealing a side we can't see? Did we have to go there, man? Did we? No. <laughs> Could the monster possibly be as wholesome as it outwardly seems? This is driving us crazy. It's driving me crazy. <gasps> I didn't mean to see that without. I saw a quick glimpse of the new monster. Give it me! That looks so cool. Is it a crab? Wait, maybe it says mech quad because that looked pretty mech. I didn't get a full on preview. We're gonna have to get this thing. Wow, I got tons of memes for that. You know, that adds so much to the song. Even though it's so minor. That's so cool. I am waiting so anxiously for this. Even though I got a, only a quick glimpse. I don't really know what's going on. But I know it had four legs. Maybe it bounces up and down. Do something wild. You know something which I'm really grateful for now? The fact that I know it is going to eat my monster. The synthesizer just gobbles up your monster which you use for the quads. I didn't even realize that inside of my wave two reaction. I'm glad I know that now. Yuri was gone and I didn't even know it. <laughs> Man, I love that sound so much. That does something unheard of for the song. It's just making me vibe more. 
I love that. Oh, we got it. Okay, that's awesome. Oh my god, look at this egg. Yeah, this is totally the mech boss. That's so interesting. Maybe it's going in order of release then because it went Gar, Strebro, Grumpire. So maybe the Shadow Quad is up next then. Oh, interesting. Okay, let's go ahead and get this thing. Before we do, I think I'm going to stand up because the workshop is such a bop. I feel like I need that movement. Oh, it feels like whale all over again. I'm so excited. Let's go then. What was this one name? I can't remember. It had a really cool name though, didn't it? Let's have a look. Oh, that sounded cool. Then Sean. Oh, it's like a little professor kind of. Oh. Oh, look at the metallic legs dangling from it. Oh, with well, you could not see that it was a plasma boss, but this one, you can see that this is meant to be the mech boss, which is really cool. Well, honestly, looked like the shadow boss, didn't it, Ma? than the plasma quad. <laughs> That's weird how things worked out. Ooh, ooh, I bet this is gonna have really cool animations. The wood saw, oh, the, how is that gonna work? That is actually so creative in the steam pipes. Maybe it's gonna make sounds from that as well. It sound definitely did sound like it was gonna do something special. Venshun, invention, venshun. Oh, okay. We're having a vibe, it's workshop. I kind of wish I could place Epic Willoughby down here. <laughs> okay, what are you gonna do? Yo, how does this work? This is so cool. That is the, such an inventive sound. Just like flask. That works so well. That adds a bunch. Are you joking me right now? How is that so cool? How did the, all these inventive sounds add so much? Yo, that is so cool. How does a monster like that? Add oh boy. Wow, this wave is so cool. I think I like this more than wave too. Well, though, it's hard to beat. So satisfying in such an unusual way, this one. When they did Flask, I didn't think we'd have something else like this. Wow, I think with this island, we've maybe got to think more abstract in terms of the instruments we have. Because if we're looking at the ones we have, like Flask, and then now this one, they just seem to be making up instruments on the fly, which is so cool because they are unusually adding so much to the song. This one actually makes me vibe so much in such an unusual way. Oh man, that was so cool. I love, oh, I love this part as well. Oh, I love these. Okay, let's have a look at you. Look at your bio. Can't help it, I just wanna dance. <laughs> this one had so much. Behold, a workshop within the workshop. Oh, that is clever. <laughs> Fitting like the mech quad vention. Invention. <laughs> Looks like the wooden workbench of Monster Antiquity, where items and decorations alike were crafted. Oh! Oh, another superpower behind the ethereal monsters. Wow, so these help maybe the Colossals in making 
the monster world. Zaro, hey, uh, ethereal colossal, I think you had more going on here than what you're letting on. If that works, Ben sprang to life and swapped crafting for clanging. Not only is this contraption itself a product of mechanical invention, it's an inventor in its own right. The monster is constantly experimenting with the materials available to devise new gadgets and gizmos. Not unlike the celestial that shares its elemental affiliation. Oh, rumors swell that it's planning a high make heist to distract Zari and escape to the great beyond. Oh, I love this monster. This is so cool. Wow. And escape into the great beyond, but we're not sure the world is prepared for Venshin impact. <laughs> Genshin Impact. Well, my sister would like that joke. Wonderful. <laughs>Far is gonna go down crazy if this was this good. The amping it up now. Okay, I, I actually want to just stand here and dance all day. But thank you so much for watching my reaction today. It's been so surreal today. I can't believe I got so much. What I just love so much today. I will see you guys later. Make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed because it helps more than you guys will ever know. This is a bang wave, guys. This is so cool. Anyway, bye.